Next panel up here right now, you're going to meet some incredible folks. Uh, and we're going to have the ladies that we designated to come up and up on stage. You, come on. You, come on. Uh, when Dave talked about tearing up, um, an affliction that I have often, um, it's about your emotions being close enough for you to touch them. This gentleman right here talked to me about, and we'll talk about it on, on stage in this panel, not just the tech side, but the spiritual side, correct? And spirit does, spiritual doesn't necessarily mean God always. It means being in touch with the thing that makes you special. And there is no creative person that doesn't touch something deep to do something special. So don't get all macho and feel like you can't do that. It's important that you get in touch with it. It doesn't mean you have to cry. It doesn't mean you have to be a whim, because it doesn't mean that. It means that you're going to get in touch. And every great creative person I know has that capacity. When I worked with, there was a band that probably your parents know with somebody. How many people know about Earth, Wind, and Fire? Come on. Yeah. Okay. So before Pensado's place, I was partnered with Maurice White for seven years, went on the road with him. Now Maurice has Parkinson's. He's had it as long as Muhammad Ali. He stopped touring. And to the even then, he would write and find things. He told me a couple stories. There was a big hit for him called Fantasy. And it, he got inspired by watching The Shining. And he was just in the movie theater, and he was like, something was coming out of me. And he ran out of the theater in tears, and he went to his car, and he just poured this song out because he was inspired. you got to be in touch with that in order to get to that and to be great. Uh, September was him watching the civil rights riots in Washington, D.C. He was just looking out of his hotel room, and he was trying to come because he didn't like to go out after shows, and he just started writing. So I'm just saying for those people who struggle with that, know that at the end of that journey is something, with all due respect, what they'll tell you, I would say, Dave, I'm probably the most emotional guy of our little group. I think about that. Uh, you're an emotional person, for sure. Yep. In our group, emotions run high, so I guess you are the poster child, my friend. So, but that's where all the creativity stuff comes, because it's in that moment where I Absolutely. think about it.